Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Nick Mekin here with Pick Dogs. Today is November 29, 2023, and I'll be covering the first half of the NBA slate this season. All we care about on this show is the first and the second quarter. That is it. If I don't say the spread in the bet, the play will always be a money line bet. But before I get into my free plays, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you're looking for my top plays, head on over to pickdogs.com and check out our premium picks tab. That's where you'll find my top plays for just $20. And best of all, all of our daily packages come with credit guarantee. You can read more about this on our website under any daily package we cappers have to offer. Now let's roll right into today's games. We got game number one between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Detroit Pistons. Right now the Lakers are currently this season 10 and 8. They are 3 and 6 on the road, struggling on the road early on this season. They're 7 and 3. In their last 10 games played, just losing 138-94 against the Philadelphia 76ers. LeBron James only had 18 points um, in that loss right here. Both Davis and LeBron James here are game-time decisions versus this Detroit Pistons team. But man, have they been brutal. Detroit's coming in 2-15 and this season, 1-7 and at home. 0-10 in their last 10 games, and yes, they are on a 14-game losing streak. The only upside I could say right now for this Detroit Pistons team is Cade Cunningham. He's the only guy in Detroit that they got hopes for here. He's averaging right now 22 point two points per game. Um, that's all I could say about this Detroit Pistons team until I see otherwise. Absolutely smacking the Los Angeles Lakers here in the first half, even though Davis and LeBron James might not be in this lineup. I think at least one of them will be in the lineup here tonight and get the job done early against this brutal Detroit Pistons team. That's why in game number one, between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Detroit Pistons, we are smacking the Pistons or I'm sorry, we're smacking the Los Angeles Lakers first half. So we're on to game number two between the Los Angeles Clippers and the Sacramento Kings. Right now, the Clippers are currently 7-9 this season, 2-6 on the road, 4-6 in their last 10 games. Just coming off a loss here to the Nuggets, 113-104. to It's good, though, to see Kawhi Leonard in his performance against this Denver Nuggets team, scoring 31 points. Um, like I said, having Kawhi back, getting into rhythm, really Really good seeing him um, have success here against the Nuggets, especially offensively. Then the Sacramento Kings, they're hot right now. They're 9-6, and six, though, this season. They play their best basketball here at home. They're 4-1, 7-3 in their last 10 games. Just beating up on that T-Wolves team, like I said yesterday, 124-111. It's going to be an interesting, fun showdown here between Fox and Paul George. Um, both guys... Um, playing real good basketball and leading both sides, both teams here offensively. So I think it's going to be a, um, a showdown here. I think I'm leaning more towards this Sacramento Kings just because they play real good here at home. Um, they're 4-1 on the season, like I said, and the Clippers here are 2-6 and six on the road. That's why in game number two, between the Los Angeles Clippers and the Sacramento Kings, we are smacking the Kings first half. So we're on to our third and final game between the Philadelphia 76ers and the New Orleans Pelicans. Right now, the 76ers are currently 12-5 this season, 5-2 on the road. 6-4, though, in their last 10 games. They are on a two-game winning streak here, just coming off that win, like I said earlier, to the Lakers, 138-94. Joel Embiid had a triple-double in that game, 30 points, 11 rebounds, and 11 assists. They'll be matched up, though, against this hungry New Orleans Pelicans right now that are 9-9 nine and nine this season, 500 here, 6-4 and four at home. They're 5-5 five and five in their last 10 games. They are on a two-game losing streak, though, just dropping to a bad, bad Utah Jazz team, 114-112. Zion did have 26 points in that loss, but clearly wasn't enough for these Pelicans. I think the Pelicans come out. They know who they're playing here in the Philadelphia 76ers and Joel Embiid. I think Zion um, steps up to the occasion and comes out of the gates here strong with Brandon Ingram here offensively. I'm actually taking the New Orleans Pelicans here in the first half in game number three against the Philadelphia 76ers. Let's take a recap of the selections that I've chosen for you today. Game number one between the Los Angeles Lakers and the Detroit Pistons. We are smacking the Lakers first half. Game number two between the Los Angeles Clippers and the Sacramento Kings. We are choosing the Sacramento 
Sacramento Kings first half. In our third and final play, between the Philadelphia 76ers and the New Orleans Pelicans, we're smacking the Pelicans first half. Once again, this is Nick Mekin with Pick Dogs. If you have not done so, smack that like button. Helps me out a ton, and it costs you guys none. And if you're looking for my premium picks, my lock of the day, check that description below. The link is there, and I will see you guys tomorrow.